waiting for people to sign on. We're going to start in about two minutes. You got about a minute to start. I'm gonna have you guys just set up and hop on and wait for 10.30 and then we'll begin shortly. As we wait for people to hop on, I'm just going to introduce myself. You guys know me. I'm Mel Ocampo. I'm from the Dover YMCA. We'll be doing 30 minutes of body combat today, followed by about 10 minutes of core to give you guys a full body workout. And all you need for today, if you're going to do core with us, is a mat or a soft carpeted area. If you prefer that, if not, no worries. So um, let's begin mixed martial arts movement, let's get into it. So adjusting music here. Alright, let's start this from the top. And let's go. All right, right combat stance, right foot in front. Let's begin. Jab, cross, jab, cross. So you're gonna hit the nose, slip and chin of your opponent. Strike with the two big knuckles. Combination, jab, jab, cross. One, one, two. Yep. Nice, easy start to the warm up. Jab and cross. One, two, one, two. All right, so you want to rotate the shoulders side to side. Start bringing heat into the upper body. Combination, four, three, two, one. Jab, jab, cross. Let's go. One, one, two. Four, three, two, one. You guys got it. Start rolling through the shoulders. Yep. One more. Double uppercut right, double left. So the uppercut up and under the chin, using the two big knuckles to strike. Now four uppercuts here. Two hooks, right? 
left. Four uppercuts, hook right, hook left. Now in the hook, you want to turn the hip to the side, add in the power to help with the upper body. Couple more. Last one here. Now you're going to shuffle to the front, cross, shuffle back, jab. Hook, I mean. <laughs> All right, back to the combo. Four, jab and cross. Jab, jab, cross. One, one, two. Now do a little bit more by dropping the back knee. Last one here. And hold. Shake out the arms. Right side's done. Now we move to the left. Jab, cross. So use this time to breathe. Easy on the shoulders. Jab, jab, cross. One, one, two. Boom. Start dropping that back knee down. Jab it cross. Remember, try to rotate the shoulders to hit your obliques. Combination. Four, three, two, one. Jab, jab, cross. Go. Now maybe this time you can corkscrew the thumb down to get into the delts. Boop. Cut, double left, and then double right. Up and over those shoulders. Figure eight with the upper body. Side so the sides of the body. Now four uppercuts. Two hooks, left, right. Now in the hook, you want your elbow to be right in line with the shoulders, yeah? That's gonna get into your arm. You're gonna shuffle to the front, cross, shuffle back, hook, cross, hook. Your combination, jab, cross, jab, 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 cross. One, one, two, four, three, two, one. Yeah, and this finishes your upper body warm up, you guys. Boom. One more. And hold. Check it down. It's lower body now. Three knees right. Step, step, and left. Three, two, one. Step, step, right. So you're going to lift a little bit higher by maybe adding a hop if you want. Maybe lifting the knee past your hip. Do that one more time. Level three, reach higher this time. Lift up the heart rate a little bit more. Do that one more each side. Last one. New move. Front kick, right side. Front kick, kick. Front. So you're going to use the ball of the foot to strike and target the opponent's chest. If you want more, you're going to do a push kick. This time, you're going to slam the ball of the foot into the chest of your opponent. Slam it down. Push and pull. Cha. Cha. 
and hold. All right, let's set up your roundhouse knee. Right foot in front, right knee up and down. Up, down. So the shin is parallel onto the floor. We kick out and in. So the arm comes out for balance. Your shin is gonna strike the lower leg of the opponent. And if you want to go a little bit higher, lean away from the leg and lift the knee out in. Do that one more time. Shuffle to the right. Side kick right. Shuffle back. Scissor here. Four, three, two, one. You can take it low. You can march. Or scissor. Two more. Now in the side kick. Use the blade of the foot to strike your opponent at the ribs or the shoulder. Hold. All right. Let's switch sides. Left knee comes up. Up. So you want your standing heel directly in line with your opponent. That's going to allow you to open the hips and target a little bit more with precision. Again, if you want to go higher, you're going to lean away from the leg. Ha. One more time. We're going to shuffle to the left. Side kick left. Shuffle back, scissor. In the scissor, you want those knees soft. One more. Hold. And I increase the volume a little bit here. All right, combat two. We're going to focus on jab, cross, hook, pulse. One, two. One, two, hook. All right, there's the hook. We're going to integrate the core more by hunching over and whipping that hip. Adding on one knee and check. Remember the check? We're going to open up the body to the left side. Keep going. Ooh. One, two. Yeah. So if you want more, use the right hand to push a little harder. So you're going to shift your weight forward. Thunder kick to the left. Side kick right. Let's go. Thunder kick. So you're gonna slam your heel onto your opponent's thigh or ribs. You're gonna thrust your hips forward. And if you want more, you're gonna add a hop. Hit. Again, I'm pulling down, add a little hop, land with soft knees. One more, jab cross hook, knee and check, from the top. Maker. Remember, you can also lift the heel if you want. Gives you more power. Four more. Now we're going to add on the thunder kick and the side kick. It looks like this. Open up. You guys ready? Let's add it on. 
jab cross, knee check. One thunder kick, one side kick. Two more. Hold. All right, shake it out. Catch in some air. We're going to do the left side. Jab, cross, hook, pulse. Forward and back. Jab, cross, hook. Fixing my mic here. Adding on. Knee and check. So you want to open up to the right side this time. You got four more here. The maker. One more. Thunder kick right side. Side kick right. Step, kick, step, side. Handle it. You guys ready for level two? Add power and a hop. So the knee goes in and out. Push, pull. Jab cross, knee and check. From the top, round two. We're gonna add on here. Now kick and side kick. One, two, hook, thunder kick. Side kick. You guys ready to take it up level two? Let's go. Add a hop. If you want. it that's your combat too all right first feet coming up we're going to focus on upper body all right all boxing working through that first peak oh, easy jog here breathe reset take your right foot in front right combat stance easy jabs so you just want to breathe. You need to shake your arms out. That's all good. It's good to reset. And then as you reset, you slowly take your heart rate up. Step, jab, go. Add the footwork if you want. Shifting your body a little bit more forward. We hit our first combo. Watch. One, one, two. Jab, jab, cross. Yeah. If you notice my cross, I drop my back knee. Giving my cross a little bit more power. <laughs> Adding on. Hook, hook. Let's get it. One, one, two. Hook, hook. Small hook, big hook. In the big hook. 
step a little further to exude more power. Hold. All right, take out your right arm. Let's move on to the left. Get a quick jog here. And let's focus left side. Step and jab. Again, you want to be shifting your weight forward. Yeah? This helps how we train for power. Brace your core so you have that control in the upper body. Combination. Jab, jab, cross. One, one, two. Again, back knee drops down. Allowing me to have more power in the cross. Adding on. Small hook, big hook. Let's go. Small, big. Small hook, big hook. One more here. Easy. Check it out. Breathe. <sighs> Start with an easy jog. We're going to do a little bit of ring work. Moving off the center. Three jabs, right side. Four jabs. Four. Jog right here. Other side. Four uppercuts. Four, three, two, one. Four uppercuts. Right, left, right. Switch sides. Four uppercuts. All right, we're going to speed it up. Three jabs. Three uppercuts. Three, two, one. Three jabs. Three uppercuts. One, two, three. Now, just the jabs right here. One, two, one, two. Feet out wide, sink into the heels, and focus on extending the arms and rotating the shoulders. We're gonna travel again. Here we go. Three jabs right. Uppercut. Three, two, one. Three jabs. Uppercut. One more. Jabs. Let's go. Right down here. Now a little bit faster than your last tempo. Go against the beat. It's okay. Go for it. Yeah. Hold. All right. We got one more round. We're gonna stay center. Easy jog. But this time we're gonna focus on power. How can we isolate from the core and let it bring it out from the upper body? Feet out wide. Five uppercuts. Five, four, three, two, one. Hook. Hold. Now. Five, four, three, two, one. Hook. We speed it up. Five, four, three, two, one, hook. Five, four, three, two, one, hook, right. You guys ready? Add a power hook. Hook. Five, four, three, two, one, power hook. Power hook. Now the power hook. You're gonna shift your weight to the side. Little hop and jump. Let's go. Hook. One more. 
Now just the jabs. One, two, one, two. To the end. Thirty seconds here. To the end. Can you reach your peak heart rate through your power jabs? Come on. Ah. Four counts. Four, three, two. Done. Done. Oh my goodness. I'm give you guys a quick break through that. All right. Just let you guys breathe, shake out your arms, and all of that fun, fun stuff. All right. So. We've got a little bit of legs, okay? And then um, some upper body, and then finish out with a Muay Thai. So let's focus on the legs, slow the heart rate down, and let's get to it. All right, feet out wide, arms across the chest. Triple pulse squat. Left leg front kick, triple pulse, right leg front kick, in the front kick, brace your core and lean back. Lift the chest and then drop your hips to that knee level. So you want your knees pushed out, okay? We're creating some build-up for our legs. Right leg goes back. Seven lunges here. Three, two, one. Power knee goes up. Your right knee goes up to your hip height. In three, two, one, up. You're using your lower abs to pull the knee through. Triple pulse squat. Right front kick. Triple pulse. Left front kick. So use this time to shake your legs or reset because we're going back to those lunges. Yeah. Here we go. Slide the right leg back. Lunge. Seven, six. Five, four, three, two, one. Power knee up, drop, two. Let's not forget form. So lift the chest up, core engage to keep the upper body stable. And yeah. Now single knee, single lunge, and single front kick. We got 16 of these. We're working on muscular endurance, you guys. Ah, eight more, go. Definitely feel that burn. One more, drop. Yeah, shake out your legs. We got the other side. Triple pulse, right front kick. Left front kick. Again, shake your legs and reset. Left leg, lunge back. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, power knee up, drop. Again, reset, push that front knee out. Ah. Triple pulse squat. Right front, left front kick. Right front kick. Left. How are the legs? 
the mighty talking, right? Whew. Again, left leg slides back, lunge, seven, six, five. Power knee, lift it up, go. Yeah. Single time. Lunge, kick, lunge, kick. 14, 13. I have that feeling too of the burning sensation. Do what you can. Tap it if you want to. But just keep moving. Four, three, two, one. Done. Oh man, yes, here we go. <sighs> Shake out your legs, okay. I'm gonna ask you guys to get your mats out this time as you move through your push-ups and a little bit of core training, okay? So if you've done this with me last week, we're gonna do an MMA conditioning track and then focus on some push-ups and core work, okay? A lot of endurance here. Okay, right foot in front. Easy jog here. First move, two uppercuts. Upper, upper, hook, hold, pulse. Let's do that again. Upper, upper, hook. So from the get-go, get in that power. Use your hips to help move the body from the hips to the core. Upper, upper, hook. All right, that move, but we're gonna speed it up. One, two, three, four, hold. Do that again. One, two, hook. All right, ready? Ba, ba, ba. All right, that move, but we're gonna repeat four times. Here we go, in three, two, four combos. Upper, upper hook, two, hook. Now you're gonna jump four times, in four, three, two, hold. That's your combo, upper, upper hook. Jump four times, bend the knees, when you take off and land. All right, back to the upper, upper hook. Now jump six times. Six, five, four, three, two, one, hold. Do it again. Upper, upper hook. If you don't want to jump, then it look like this. Pulse it down. Hold. Upper, upper hook. Now jump eight times. Eight, seven, six. Again. If you want to add a tuck, add a tuck, knees to chest, and hold. Woo. Man, my tuck took my breath away. I need help there. <laughs> All right, when you're ready, come to the ground, get your mat up, and bring your arms wider than your chest. You're gonna do a power push up, down and up. Down, up, down, up. Chest comes down to elbow level. We're gonna add on to this. Right arm, left arm, add the row. Now you don't have to add the row. You can even just hold in plank on your knees or your toes, it's up to you. Come to mountain climber position. Hands narrow, mountain climber. 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Hold, do it again. 12 count. 
hold, two more, hold, last one, 16 counts, and hold, oh man, drip, sweat, over, but we're not done, we got the left side, so put your mat aside, Shake it out. Let's get up. All right, power. Upper, upper hook. One, two, hook. Hold, pulse. Catch your breath. Do it again. Here we go. Four quick ones. Upper, upper hook. Four jumps. Four, three, two, one, hold. Let's do that again. Upper, upper hook. Yeah. Jump. Let's go. Jump six. Again. Jump. Go. Jump eight times. Eight. Again. Eight times. Hold. You can do push-ups. Come on. Try doing this together. Whew. Hands out wide. When you're ready. Do you feel you need to shake out your arms a little bit longer? That's okay. When you're ready, come and join me. Down, up. You guys ready for this? Left arm, right arm, go. <sighs> Mountain climbers, 12 seconds here and hold. Do it again. Hold. Again, go. Hold. 16 counts, go. And done. I'm gonna pause the music. Give you guys time to drink. Wipe off some sweat. Man, that was a scorcher, right? Put your mat to the side. All right, we've got one last track to lift up your heart rate. Then we're gonna move on to core. Okay, let's do this. All right, Muay Thai. So we're gonna do knees and elbows as a source of our weapon to attack our opponent. One, two, three, two circular elbows. Two elbows. Jab, cross, jab, two elbows. In the elbow, use the pointed end to draw a straight line across your opponent's chest. Back knee. 16 times. We're gonna put it together. Jab, cross, jab. Two elbows, four back knees. Four, three, two. Do it again. 
four, three, two, one. Elbow. Let's go. Descend, ascend, pulse. Again, down, up. Remember the descending elbow. Think of it as an oblique core crunch. Ascending elbow, biceps come by your ears. One more. Now four elbows, down, up. Four front knees, four elbows, knee. Jab, cross, jab, cross. Two elbows. Back knee four times. Elbow, knee. You guys got this. To the end, go. Hold. Breathe. Reset. We're going to switch sides, all on to the left. Jab, cross, jab. Elbow. Again. Continuous. Breathe. Back knee. 16, 15, come on. Combination, jab, cross, jab, two elbows, back knee, four, three, go, all on the left. Descend, ascend. Down, up. So in the elbows, your hands are relaxed. Using that to grab the head of your opponent. Four elbows. Four front knees. Jab, cross, jab, cross. Elbows. Back knee. Again. Hold. Oh! We got one more. And this is it. So breathe, reset. You guys ready? Two knees, right side. Two left. Now eight on the left. Right side. Add the power knee. Eight power right. Eight. Left go switch. Huh. Switch. Switch. Four power knees right, four. Switch. 
switch, switch, running man, go to the end, this is it you guys, four, three, two, done, done, made it, you guys made it, awesome job, all right, grab a drink, we're going to move on to some core work, Is hang out there, quick core work to finish off your workout. Ooh, how did that feel, y'all? All right, we're gonna do Tabata through our core. We're gonna four, do four moves, two rounds. So each move will be done 20 seconds with a 10 second rest. All right, your first move is gonna be a hip raise. So you're gonna lay down your mat, bring the knees over the hips. You're gonna lift up and down, lift up and down, squeezing the butt. If you prefer, you can also do the glute bridge pulses up here, all right? Let's begin. Lay down on the mat. All right, 20 seconds. Hip raise, lift. So pressing the palm of the hand down the mat, squeezing the butt, and kicking the heel up to the ceiling. And hold right here. All right, next move is gonna be a flutter kick. So have your hands right by your side, close to you. Extend the legs out to the 45, and you're gonna flutter it up, down, up, down. All right, tuck the chin, press that lower back on the mat. Seconds here. Three seconds. And hold, 10 second rest. All right, two more moves. All right, next move is a pulse tap. Knees over the hips. You're gonna reach under the ankle or heels can be down, but tap, tap, tap. Lift shoulder blades off. Come on. And done, all right. One more, we've got the bicycle twist. All right, hold, hold, hold. All right, knees over hips, bicycle twist. Let's go. Legs can be tapped or extended. And hold. All right, we're going to repeat it from the top. All right, those four core workouts, we're going to repeat from the top. Hip raise. All right, kick the heel up to the ceiling. Up, 20 seconds. Let's go. And hold. All right. Next move is the flutter kicks. All right. Extend the legs out Exercise. and flutter it here. One, two, one, two. Almost there. Five seconds. Four, three. Oh, yes. all right, two more moves, all right? Hold, hold, hold. Exercise. 
exercise. All right, 20 seconds, pulse tap. Reach under the ankles. Rock the shoulder blade off that mat or carpet. And hold. All right, last one is your bicycle twist. Then you guys are done. All right, stick with it, stick with it. Come on. Knees over hips. Exercise. Bicycle twist. Let's go. Twist, twist. Open that chest to the front. Okay, and to the back. That's how we're going to get to the obliques. 10 seconds here. Come on. And Last. done. Oh, yes. Done, done, done. All right, extend your arms out over the head. Switch out your arms. Done. Great workout. You've spent four minutes, seven seconds exercising. That's right. Four minutes for the core just to finish everything out. And then let's go ahead and release our back and stretch and cool down. All right, let the knees fall off to one side of the room. And then let it fall to the other side. Hope you guys can join next week. I plan to switch up the music. So I'm planning for 30 minutes of combat and then maybe 15 minutes for core, where we can even do some standing core, maybe some band work. All right, get your front leg, extend it out. And switch sides. All right, come to tabletop position as you make our way to down dog. Tuck the toes, lift the hips up. And then walk the feet closer to the hands, rolling your vertebrae up one at a time. Four, three, two, and one. All right, face the center, big inhale here. Exhale and down. Fist to hand. Thank you so much for joining us today. Stay with the fight. Take care. Have a wonderful Wednesday. Bye.